Hello, beautiful people. My name is Naila, your host for the Art of Living show. Our guest today is a creative with a knack of entrepreneurship. Her appetite for interior design is insatiable. Her sense of style is timeless, elegant, and classic. She is the CEO of Kaka Yeke and Decoden. She's a mother of two and is married to a venture entrepreneur, Chris Senano. She invites us to her home to have a look around, discover and indulge. She is very private, but guess what? That's what we do in Art of Living Show. Welcome. Hello, Nina. How are you? Oh, good. How are you? Oh, wow. Thank you. These are for you. I hope oh. you love flowers. Of course, I do love flowers. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you very much. You. My goodness, your space is beautiful. Oh, thank I love you. it. Are you going to give me a tour to your home? Oh, yes. You're yeah. Welcome. Thank you. Oh, well, let me start with this. Mm -hmm. That's my hallway table. That's your hallway table. You come right into my house and you can look at yourself. I can look at myself. Yeah. Oh, I love it. Um, they look like you bought them together or you got them together or it's just... Oh, yes, the just, mirror and the hallway table like it. You, you, you bought them Those together. Things, yeah. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. So how big yeah. is your house? Mm, we have a four-bedroom house. Okay. We're only four. You're only four. <laughs> nice. Yeah, four. I, I, I can tell from yeah. here your style is contemporary. Yes very slick and sophisticated. I don't know what I expected. I think because of your fashion line, like what I'm wearing today. Oh, yes, I thought, okay, you know, okay. <laughs> I was expecting a lot of African print and everything. But talk to me about the contemporary style, you know. This is the season for contemporary. Okay. Um, so every time I change my style. Yeah. And so um, I'm in the nude phase. You're in the nude phase. Yeah. Okay. So right now, welcome to our nude house. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. of the house and there's a lot of design you know like your roof i can tell what do you call gypsy gypsy oh, ceiling? my ceiling yes. yes my ceiling instead of using the normal standard ceiling i yeah. use the gypsum ceiling all right the gypsum board gypsum to board. create that okay. effect because okay. we know gypsum board is flexible so it's you flexible. can be able to create any design that you want on your ceiling between all the colors i chose for this particular room mm -hmm. i chose to go with the nude mm -hmm. um which is most people call it beige. Yes. Yeah. So it's, all it's, tones of beige. All tones, because I can yeah. see they so vary. So I can get they vary in different textures. Plus your curtains. So they also. Yes. So okay. My curtains. I chose mm -hmm. a plain color mm -hmm. because, of course, due to my Changing changes of, of season. season. Yes. It's less expensive. All right. So that way I'm able to change other things, other accessories instead of my curtains because that would cost me too much. All right. Yeah. Okay. But then my scatter cushions, I can reupholster my seats when I want to change. Yes. So currently we, you can see even my seats are plain. Yes. But with Your seats are not fabrics. plain. Well, but the back yeah. is plain. You yeah, can the see back. the front. Okay. I mean, the front is plain. And then yes. I have a little print on the sides. Yeah. I like African. Okay. Because uh, of course I have an African brand. Yes. Uh, fashion line. Yes. So even the the, the design on oh, my right. scatter cushions yes. has the African print. Okay. Yeah. Um, this is a lot on the mud cloth. Yes. Yeah, oh, mud cloth. The yeah, texture. The, uh, the print. The print. If you look at the mud cloth, um, yes. it has this particular design. Oh, it has that particular yeah. design. Okay. So I love I it. That. You know, it somehow doesn't look very African for some reason. Yeah. It looks very classy. Somehow it borders contemporary. Uh, no, 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 Victorian. Yes, it still Somehow gives you that Victorian look, look but, but it's not still, African, but yes, still African. still gives you with an African. Yes. You can still see the African print on it. And the chairs are yeah. very unique. I can tell, you know, in terms of your furniture, how you've picked your furniture. It's not the normal furniture. I can tell this is, is this wood? Yes, the, it's wood. It's just that it's painted. Really? Yes. What type of wood is this? It looks um, very different from what we know or what we see yeah. locally. Uh, well, you see the design of the wood. Mm -hmm. I guess you know these days they use a lot of, is it called, um, I forget what the Sawdust? Name. That sawdust to yes. carve, yeah, to create the wooden carves so that you're able to paint over it. Okay, yeah. okay, And because okay. I want different colors sometimes, yes. then All right. I'll be able to change this, the, the outline. The outline of the yeah, seat. Of whatever I want. And upholstery as well. And then I well. can also change the upholstery. As you wish. Yeah. Fantastic. So anytime that I want to change the style, then yes. I can be able to. 
quickly paint over. Paint over I want over to it. take it back to the dark brown look. Yeah. Yes, then I can still do that. Mm. That yeah. um, fireplace is very unique as well. It's one of those uh, homes I've been to, but it looks very different. Mm -hmm. I guess my fireplace was a focal point. Okay. So I was trying to understand and to make sure that I get something that's more creative okay. and is not normal, let's say, yes. that everybody, I mean, that is different, let me just say. Unique. Yes. So yes. I picked that mosaic. It's actually yes. a tile All right. that you can create and okay. put it together. All right. Yeah. Such that then it creates that effect. Because this the is texture. a focal point yes, that's of a, your home. Yeah. We all know that most of the time you only find chandeliers in the centerpieces, but yours yeah. is on the wall. So you can actually get this. Have you seen this? Actually, this is called like a wall bracket. Uh, wall bracket. Call it a chandelier. chandelier is the one that hangs yes. from the ceiling. Okay. Yeah, but you can always create a chandelier effect. You can create a chandelier Which is effect. what I did. Yeah, with okay. the teardrops. Okay, okay, with, with the teardrops. Yeah. Okay, all yeah. right. So these teardrops, we just hang them on this. Oh, you hang so them? You say using the uh, wire mesh. Yes. Yeah. So, so did you, you, this, you sourced differently? Yes. Oh, so nice. So sourced it differently and then okay. decided to create this tree effect. And okay. So that then it gives that beautiful, glamorous, glamorous and sophisticated. Elegant, sophisticated look. Yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. I love yeah. it. Yeah. I have um, noticed a beautiful, um, the, oh, the side table. Yeah, the so, side table. Yeah. And it's all mirrors. And yes. it looks very functional because I think it's also drawers. Yes, you know, mirrors are in fashion also. All right. Um, they are in a lot right of hallway now. tables have mirrors. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then I like I like the elegance and for that particular nook space, yes. I could be able to keep stuff and I wanted to do like an... Um, a montage, a of, montage of my of family, your pictures. family pictures. Yeah, so Beautiful. then it was able to... Yes, yeah, and those two together. centerpieces are beautiful. Yes, that's my brick of color. The brick pop of, of color. color. I call it the pop of color. So pop I'm going to work on that teal yes. and accessorize my whole house. And my goodness. Welcome to my dining room. Thank you. <laughs> it looks amazing. I love, love, love love this chandelier. Oh, you're welcome. Oh my goodness, where did you source this from? Oh. It is so classy, sophisticated, it and it's yeah, unique well. and yeah. slick. <laughs> yes, I like the lighting. One, it's not too bright. Yes. Yeah, and just provides enough light on the table, so yes. it focuses right on your table. Okay. And because of the reflection of the glass, yes. actually the crystals reflect on my glass. So I oh, really, does really it? Like it. Yeah. Oh, yes, it yeah. does, actually. Yeah, because then if you sit here, yes. mean, on a normal day, we wouldn't have the tables on us, so yes. we'll just have the, that, and you can see the light. Beautiful. Yeah. And I can't help but notice also your table, the design yes. is so exotic. I love the table Did design. you source this from here? No, I didn't. Okay. Yeah, but okay. you can actually have it made here. Okay. There's a gentleman who makes the tables here locally. All right. Because all you have to do is order glass. Okay. For the top base. Yes. And then, of course, choose the design that you want. For the for wood. For the base. Yes. And he can make it for you with the oh, wood. Oh, wow. Yeah. That is amazing. So some of the ideas that people, our viewers can borrow from online. Yes. And ne you necessarily don't have to source from out of the country. No. Some of these things. Some of these things you can always find them here yes. of course because you know we have good people who can do good work yes so as long as you supervise it and then they can actually replicate what you're looking for okay then the chairs i just bought them from a local store from a local store yeah. so do you change the chairs or they normally okay because of i guess my lifestyle yes i have children sometimes and mm -hmm. then sometimes i remove my seats and i put seats that are child friendly all right when they have their many guests okay or then if i'm entertaining um you're, you're more prestigious guests and yes. put a more prestigious chair. Okay. So it then makes the room look a bit more elegant. And more elegant yeah, and classier. And more classier. Oh, wonderful. Yeah, I love yeah. the walls. What you've done with the walls as well. Did you design this yourself? Yes, you know, at least it's um, the light, of course, uh, eliminates its light directly on the piece that yes. you want to yes. showcase. Yes. And then that space was really dead, so I thought that would be a nice space to just put in little artifacts. These two mirrors, I can't help but look at mirrors. There's the something mirrors. about you and mirrors and chandeliers. Yeah, I love that depth it creates. Yeah. I love the depth that the mirrors create. Okay. Because then if you're standing there, yes. you sort of 
think that the house is bigger. Yes. But it's really not. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And it's this is mirrors. unique. And then, yes. And then I love the whole antique look on the mirrors. Yes. And then it tied in with my chandelier. It, yes. Yeah. So then that worked very well together. Okay. Then my wall was pretty big. All right. So I did twin yeah, because instead of doing one piece, mm -hmm, yeah, because mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you can then also put a bigger mirror. You're far removed from the African feel, very removed, except that one piece. Talk to me no, about that. Especially for now, yeah, it's just the season right now. It's a season. I think I've done 10 years of African, and everybody actually, every time people come to me, I'm like, Oh, I thought your house would be completely African. I'm like, No. Mm -hmm.